Well, you certainly don't have to travel too far here in Oklahoma to catch a glimpse of a train. And if it seems to you like trains are getting longer these days, <laughs> well, that's because they are. Osage Sky News 6 pilot Dustin Stone explains. The Federal Railroad Administration says railroad companies have been increasing train lengths for some time, but especially in the last few years as they try to save money. We checked a couple of trains heading through Ulaga last week. We saw one that had more than 200 cars and another that had almost 300, making it about three miles long. The Federal Railroad Administration says there's no law that restricts how long trains can be, even though it says they can cause traffic problems and even be dangerous. It's because blocked train crossings may cause drivers to go around barricades and pedestrians may be tempted to crawl between stopped rail cars. Stopped trains can also delay emergency vehicles. The FRA wants to hear from anyone who has to wait on a train, including first responders. It set up a website called the Public Blocked Crossings Incident Reporter. You can use that site to quickly report when you had to wait on a train. We put the link in this story on our app. Be sure to include date, time, location, and how long the train blocked the crossing. Flying in Osage Sky News 6, Dustin Stone, Oklahoma's own News on 6.